a name plastered on campaign signs throughout the town of Evans now also appears in a police report. Mike Masulo, a candidate for town supervisor, is accused of threatening a police officer in an incident captured on that officer's body camera. You got one month, buddy. You got one month. Don't use it. Don't do it, Scott. Well, somebody better talk. Masulo is running on the Republican ticket for the town supervisor seat. He allegedly approached Officer Scott DeJohn while DeJohn was working at an unrelated scene. Well, digging into this video today, 7 News reporter Michael Wooten uncovered the details leading up to this encounter. Michael, what'd you find out? Yeah, Leah, Mike Masulo is a retired police lieutenant in Evans himself. He has known the officer in that body cam footage that he's interacting with since they were six years old. Longtime colleagues whose families have apparently been beefing for a while now, and it all came to a head earlier this month with the supervisor candidate accused of crossing the line. What's up? What's up? Hey. That's Evans Town Supervisor candidate Mike Masulo confronting a police officer who was investigating a minor car crash here along Route 20 one week ago. I'm in the middle of this. Stop, Scott, I'll no. knock you right no, out. No, you won't. Yeah, I will. You got no, you one month, buddy. You got one month. The argument led to this police report. Masulo accused of second degree harassment, a violation. The patrolman, Scott DeJohn, says Masulo began to confront him over a recent encounter with right. Masulo's nephew. Stop it. Because I'm going to call your father. This is video of that incident provided by Masulo. In it, Officer DeJohn tells several minors, including Masulo's 12 year old nephew, to stop causing trouble after a call to police from the McDonald's in Derby. Your grandfather is not the chief of police anymore. Your uncle is not a lieutenant. All right? So you better stop. Masulo told me the officer was targeting his nephew and the confrontation called on body cam footage was him, quote, standing up to a bully. Patrolman DeJohn saw it differently. Threatening an officer right there. Yeah, I know. You didn't you didn't think of that, did you? I didn't care, Scott. Well, you're gonna. The Evans Police Department decided to clear the case without filing charges. Masulo's Democratic opponent for supervisor, Ray Ashton, called Masulo's conduct unacceptable. He told me, quote, as a former police officer, Mr. Masulo should know better than to interfere with an accident scene, no matter what his reasoning was. In the body cam video, you hear Masulo say, you got one more month, says it a couple of times. Critics said that was Masulo threatening that if elected, he would fire that officer. Masulo, though, told me that's false, that he was simply referring to the patrolman almost ready to hit retirement eligibility. You can decide. I asked Masulo if he regrets what he said. He told me no, that he stands by at 100 percent. And as for why no charges were filed, the police chief told me that threats against officers unfortunately happen on a regular basis. He says they have to have thick skin. And in this case, the officer just chose not to pursue charges. Reporting live, Michael Wooten, 7 News.